within We've justified our sin And we're gonna take you on a ride Till we find answers within Location not here In shadows we all disappear Hold on, switch gears We're gone as fast as we going on governors just cool here and today we're back baby we're back for some con relic testing which i'm actually super hyped to do you all may recall the cavalry madman and specialist saz i think he is the strongest player by power who focuses on seven marches of fielding cavalry so today Oh, wrong title. Heraclius Open Field Testing. Chat, good catch. Hello? Con Relic Testing is what this is. Thumbnail good, title bad. Good catch. Con Relic Testing. Okay. Um. Let's see. Okay. Good call. Good call. I thought I updated this. This is super weird. Okay. Uh, con Relic testing in Rise of Kingdoms are okay against all the best meta marches. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Good catch. Good catch. Good catch. Busy day for Chiskel. Yeah, no kidding, guys. Oh. Woo. Woo. Busy day. Dropped a cool 1,500 bucks in Call of Dragons earlier. That was fun. Unlocked my T5s. Getting ready for the old fight, man. Big fight in Zone 2. It's crazy. And uh, then I'm streaming later tonight. So it's been a lot. Um, but let's jump in game in just a second here. Allow me to first thank my members and moderators. Benjamin, Sasuke, what's good? Curtis Gaming, how's it going, buddy? David Horick, Get Money, What's Up, Bingo Rock, Ahmed, Frederick FR, Justine Moomy, MR Troll Divided, Michael G, and Heaven's Throne. Cheers, welcome, everybody. And a big shout out to my legendary guard. Thank you for your ongoing support. I appreciate you. Thank you. Let's jump in game, shall we? Here we go. Can't wait for Sunday. Oh, yeah. Sunday's going to be crazy, man. So I'm going to jump into voice with the team. And let me see here. I'm in the wrong Discord server. Helps to be in the right server. All right. I'm back. Stream is live. We're good to go. Stream can hear me, but not you. Cool. Um... Now, hey, Onyx, welcome to the Honor Guard. 
So as one last quick reminder slash rundown on what we're doing today, here is what we're going to test. Saz is going to use Relic, Khan, and Nevsky with the best cavalry gear in the game. I am going to try to keep up with my Guan Yu using some really good gear. In fact, for this test, I'll make one more swap. Really good gear. Okay. The Nevsky is going to use really wicked gear. I am missing two Iconics. That is relevant. The Boudica, same story. Really good gear, missing two Iconics. So there is a slight gear advantage on the con. And we're going to be using line formation in order to remove the armaments from the equation. All right, chat? And at the end of this, we will know if the relic on Khan is actually viable. I think it's kind of cool. We'll see. Rock in the afternoon, cod in the morning, also cod in the evening. Yeah, it's a little crazy. So for this testing, by the way, city themes are off. We have no attack or defense tokens. To get rid of mine, I used an anti-scout token. And in the commander tab, um, Saz does not have Khan and does not have Nevsky. I do not have any of the commanders that I'm going to be using either. What skill should I upgrade first on Heraclius? The first skill. Kong, welcome to the stream. So we're going to do this relic testing and I'm pretty hyped about it. And then I'm going to make a summary video. Kind of explaining what we think of, of the relic here. Now, match starts in two minutes. We can confirm. Uh, in Ark of Osiris. Practice match. Two minutes till start. Confirming Chiskul and Chiskul Mini on the left. And Saz is on the right. Big poggers. Good to go. When not using a formation without armaments, it's just a lot easier to just switch to line formation than it is to remove the armaments and then put them back on later. They're so hard to find. Um, Justin, thank you for the very generous 50 bucks. Let's go. Hey, let's get those Justin emojis in the chat. Big poggers. Hope you're doing well, Justin. Thanks for dropping in the stream. I appreciate you, man. How about Saladin? Great news. Saz also has unlocked the relic on Saladin. So we can only test one commander per session because you can't switch your gear mid-session. So um, on another day, hopefully I'll be able to coordinate with Saz um, to do that round of testing. But I got to give a big thank you. Um, big thank you for helping with all this testing. Uh, so thank you very much. I appreciate you. Going live twice in the same day. It's actually going to be three times today. I'm, I'm full mad lad. Three live streams today. Um, let's jump into the practice match. XY Saladin. We'll have to figure out what the combo needs to be. I would think it's Saladin primary Nevsky secondary. If you wanted to make like the best Saladin march possible. Um, so in terms of which obelisk we go to, let's go to the one that's all the way in the bottom left. Does that sound good to you? So you'll take it for first, and when you teleport in, try to teleport like all the way to the right of the obelisk, as far right as you can go. And then I'll snuggle next to you just on the left by a little bit. Um, BYG Pi, thank you for the 17 months, dude. Hope the stream goes well. Cheers, thank you. Is it day one of matchmaking? It is day one of matchmaking, baby. By the way, I see all those emojis you have flowing through the chat. I love it, guys. I love it. Love to see it. Honestly, that new feature from YouTube, it's like so simple. It, you just like tap the little emoji button and then select the little emoji and it just bubbles up through the chat. It's kind of cool, man. Love to see it. The other thing I love to see is likes on the video and the stream. So 56 likes so far. Let's crank that up if we can. Mm 
Did you watch Starship launch this morning? Um, I did not. Sounds like it went well, though. Thank goodness. And we're good to go. Nothing I could do to change it now, but we are good to go. Bob Saget in the chat. SpaceX. It exploded? Wait, it went off with a bang? GG. Are you serious? It did not go well? <laughs> Chill, it didn't blow up? Now I'm just trolled. Now I'm fully trolled. I don't know what reality is. See, this is the problem with live streaming. You get your news from the chat, and who knows if the chat's trolling you or telling you the truth. Oh, it was an intentional explosion. Why did they intentionally blow it up? It was a successful explosion test? <laughs> Wait. Wait. Really? Tim Freda says, Your Discord community is amazing. I found a jumper group and started to love the game. Awesome, Tim. I'm really glad to hear that. Let's freaking go. I'm going to have to Google now. I know. God forbid we have to Google to find out the actual news. GG. Okay. Hey, time to walk. Um, I'm going to capture the one closest to me and then skip through that and head over to yours. So I'll link it in uh, Alliance chat. Saz, this is the one to go to. Rapid unscheduled disassembly was what they called it. GG. I see you're on the way. Um, are you coming to me? That would be fine if you wanted to come all the way up to me. Yeah, I see you're coming up to me. Okay, yeah, that works. Oh, uh, <laughs> either one. Um, just make sure you target outside the obelisk um, so you don't hit it before I've teleported. Uh, weapon, what's up, dude? You're about to spend for the first time in rock. What do you recommend to buy? You have 50% off. Ooh, the gem supply? Dude, that's... What, a $5 gem supply? Seems pretty good to me, man. Um, I suppose if you're City Hall 25, though, the growth fund is actually the best thing. Growth fund is insane. Gem supply is pretty good value, too. I would say the growth fund you could get any time, right? But the gem supply, you would ideally get during a uh, recharge event, potentially. You know, it depends on how much you want to spend, but you could get some extra stuff during a recharge event with just a little bit more than that first purchase. It is really wild how that escalates so quickly, isn't it? Like, you, it's like oh, it's just one thing you're going to buy, and then it becomes so many things. Um, growth fund, for sure. Where's the fog? Fog is not here yet. It's currently in pioneer mode for the version of this that has fog. All right, I can teleport soon. Minute 30. El Cid, what's up, dude? We had some fun KON KVK in LK now. Cool, dude. You're in 1717 now. All right. 
Max purchase on Living Legend is always good value. GG, Hen with the trolling. You know, the funny thing is that in Call of Dragons, it actually is really good value. It's like 185 bucks for 40 tokens. It's the equivalent of Living Legends. 40 legendary tokens, man. That still makes a hero really expensive, though. <laughs> I mean, like, you're like really expensive. You bought Mina, then couldn't stop. Rip my wallet. Hi, yi, yi. Match not found pops at reset. Does it really, Sasuke? I mean, if we get match not found, then we queue into the hell KVK, so that would be fine. I mean, we finally have some options. Hey, 2D Rap, what's up, dude? We need some KON content. Wait, what's KON? King of the Nile? All right, you're free to target the obelisk, by the way. I'm out of there. So as soon as you take it, um, we wait for the uh, cooldown, and, and you'll be able to port just to the right of me. And then we'll do our testing just below our cities. So I'll move my march out so you can see sort of where I'm thinking. Ooh, that line formation moves so fast. Actually, just going to go slightly north of, of that position. That way, when I record the video, they're on all these trees blocking the view. Oh, King of the Nile. So I have a King of the Nile fight um, on Sunday. It's, it's going to be really fun. Uh, it's against 1875. Kingsland. It's going to be really crazy. Best formation for infantry? I mean, I'm on the wedge plan, but low key, hollow square is kind of designed for infantry. Guan Caesar better than Guan Leo? Uh, probably if the Caesar's double relict, it's probably better than the Leo, actually. I don't know if it'd be better than. Would Caesar be better than Mapmad behind Skippy? No, I, I would still stick to the map the Mapmad, honestly. Double relic the Mapmad and use that. King of the Titans says, Man, I miss rock. I mean, hey. Hey, look. Oh, you marched the cab over here? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> um, we shouldn't fight uh until you teleport. Um Yeah. That's funny. Oh, I'm so hyped for this. All right, on my end, I'm going to hit the start recording button. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, I actually have a con emoji equipped, of all things. <laughs> uh, Double Relic, Ethel, or Mathmad? They're both really good. Try some Con Caesar. Dude, Con Caesar would be pretty good. I don't... I don't think... You, you don't have a double relic on your Caesar, do you? Okay. I mean, it's just... There's too many things to relic these days. You chat, you can't relic at all. Alright, so you can port just to the right of my city. And then we'll jam. That works. That's good. All right. You ready? Here we go. We're basically just going to do this like four times with each troop type combo. We see how it goes. I'm kind of afraid. Oh my god, you're winning. 
I'm low key afraid of what's about to happen. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I'm gonna lose. Now, there's a couple things going on here. One is that infantry does counter cavalry, but they do have the Arabian civilization. I think that's what that is, um, which does give them the special units. Nico Clash says, what the actual F? Yeah, no, the Relic on Saladin, uh, sorry, not Saladin, on Khan is really good. I think we're ready for a Guan Relic, chat says. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, uh, you're not wrong. It's close, but not that close. Oh, uh, maybe it is kind of that close, actually. Khan Nevsky has no AoE, whereas the Guan Skippy does. That's true. Living Death, thank you for the super. Hey, who would you pair Hosk with? And will you be doing a video on it? Yeah, I'm definitely going to do a video on Hosk. Hosk is super versatile in Call of Dragons. Um, you could use him as a secondary to just about anybody, but I wouldn't use him as the primary. All right. Uh, let's run it back to the city and do it three more times. Sheesh. So the value of doing it a bunch of times is that you know, one time, you never know what kind of randomness influences the result. 28,000 to 24,000. GG. All right, you ready? Here we go. Round two, chat. Round two. So the Khan Nevsky, that is true. It does offer a little bit of utility with a debuff, but it is mostly raw single target damage. Oh, this time I got a jump start on that. Hello? Oh, I si- Dude, the silences from Guan are actually pretty brutal here if they're timed right. That's what happened. My silence cycle just went really, really strong at the start. You just mask maxed your Skippy and you feel like you're seven foot five? Chi Chi. What's the pairing with Khan you've seen the best results with? We haven't really tested multiple pairs yet. Um, I, I have to think it's just Nevsky. Like, chat, don't you think Nevsky is where it's going to be? Like, there's no better cavalry than Nevsky. It's not Joan. We know that for sure. So your only other options are like William. I mean, yeah. Uh, Mina. Oh. Ooh. Mina's an interesting idea. No, Mina double relic is interesting. Maybe at the end we rest, mess around with Mina. Yeah, Khan Mina, that's that's that could be it. Alright, that time I get the win. Let's do it again. 28,000 to 37,000. Alright. Wouldn't you want to get someone in there with Khan who has AoE? <laughs> I mean. It is possible that you'd use like a meth med. Con Caesar. Yeah, Con Caesar's an interesting idea. I just don't think it could get much better than using the the Nevsky. Alright, here we go. Like Nevsky is just the jam, man. Like I I don't know. Mina is the only other option that I would believe is better. Potentially. But it probably isn't. Like Nevsky is really dumb chat <laughs> it's so good looks like if i don't get the silence cycle to work i get the l why aren't you doing it with no gear because the gear really changes the way the combat works especially the horn of fury why not joan so both Khan and Joan give free activations of the active skill. And what happens is you end up 
slowing down your rage cycle because there's always a second of downtime after the active skill. So Khan will do his active. There's a second of downtime. Khan will do his extra attack. Second of downtime. Joan will do hers. Second of downtime. Joan will do her free attack. Second of downtime. And you actually have made your rage cycle go slower than it would have gone. Shining Star, welcome to the Honor Guard. Yo, let's get those hype emojis for Shining Star. Cheers, welcome. Appreciate you. Why Khan Primary? Because Khan Primary has a rage reduction on the active skill. It's a little bit sneaky, but if you look at his active skill, it actually has a lower rage requirement. All right, so as if you want to run home and bring out a fresh one, let's do it again. Final test with the infantry. You're saying four skills like it's a bad thing? It turns it into a bad thing. It's why you can't put them together. Because you'd rather split them up and then you could have a seven second or a six second skill cycle. You literally slow yourself down. Shining star. Hey, thank you for the super. I appreciate you, dude. All right, here we go. Last round. Final test with the infantry. Khan not usable in the field. He's an instant target. I mean, that's why Nevsky's a pretty good secondary, right? Nevsky gives health when he's hit and is also like statted out like crazy, right? Plus, I mean, we're talking about fully crit iconic equipment on this March chat. It's the literal best in the game. Yeah, Khan Jones sounds good on paper, but in actuality, it's terrible. I mean, look, aren't we like 50-50 here on who wins? Or did he win three out of four? I actually am not sure. I have to double check. I mean, chat. Khan Nevsky looking pretty good. Can you try Saladin and Nevsky? Yeah, so Saladin relic testing we're going to do another day. All right. That is one, two, three wins for Khan with Nevsky. GG. Um, all right, let's try calves. I'll bring my calves. You bring your calves. Now it's special unit on special units. Oh, um, can you bring the con? I am really eager to do salad and testing, but it'll have to be another day. We know how this will end. Do we? I mean, now I also have my civilization special unit. No armaments, line formation to, to clean that up. All right, here we go. Konevsky cavalry round. Fight one. Here we go. I'm losing. GG. Oh my god. Do you use blue stacks for Call of Dragon or PC version? I'm on the PC version. I have also used blue stacks. Um but the PC version does have some extra punch to it. How would a con oh is Khan a viable rally? Like Khan Minamoto or Khan Nevsky Rally? I actually would assume no, but I don't know. How is Saz doing so much skill damage? That's what the combo does. Khan gets free skill damage hits, like a 30% chance of an extra skill activation. 
Uh, yeah, chat can confirm. March is good. very good. March is very good. Nevsky CC is now meta for one verse one. I would guess that Khan with Nevsky would be better. Um, I know there's Archer leaks, but I'm not able to talk about them until they're official. Yeah, I mean, that's a W trade for the con. If it's a good dueling march, it could potentially be a good rally. Exactly. Yeah, for sure. All right, here we go. Round two. Do we have an Alex relic yet? We do not. Huge single target damage, for sure. It's hard to make decisions because there's limited relics to go around. Completely agree. Why is the world turning backwards? No way Khan has defeated Legendary Joan. What's next? Bjorn at the top of the meta? High damage glass cannon? I mean, these results have got to make Saz really happy. Right? Like, A, your relic is worth, but B, being the 7 March Cavalry Wonder, like, yeah. That's, this is also really good news. I mean, first of all, this is only a single relic on Khan, so if they add a double relic, hello, that would be insane. But also... Like, you could actually now invest in Khan in the early game and get value from him in the late game, right? I'd still rather have Nevsky Joan on the field. Oh, chat. Hey, look, let me tell you something. I have seen some reports with Hannibal Barca that would make you blush. I'm, like, not gonna lie. I have seen reports with Hannibal Barca that will make you blush. It is shocking. Cod now rock. Hope your sleep is okay. Uh, let's not talk about my sleep. I have a newborn. My, my sleep is pretty effed. Okay, round three of four. Here we go. How about con XY? Um, you could, but... It, 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 it kind of defeats the purpose to put them together, right? Like, both XY and Khan have a lower rage requirement on their active skill. You can see that by clicking on the active skill and seeing in red the rage requirement. So it just feels like you'd want to split them up anyways, right? Um, you could pair them together. I suppose they both have rage reductions. It's, it's like, interesting, but... Yeah, I don't know. Frankie Joe, you DM'd me a Barca report. Nice. So should you invest in Khan in the early game? I still want to say no, but it kind of depends on how good the new archer is. Like, if the new archer is insane, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I guess once we finish up the gauntlet, okay, we have one more Nevsky Joan test. Then we're gonna go do archers. And once we've done archers, I think what we could do is test like Khan with XY. But first we gotta do one more round of this. I think GK is Squarely in the category of viable, but probably not meta. All right, last test with the Nevsky Joan on my end. Then we go to archers. I think you're just going to decimate my archers, dude. But for science, we do four tests. All right. Here we go. Final round. 
Relict Con chat. Relict Con. By the way, we have exactly 666 people in the live stream chat. Consider throwing a like on the stream and subscribing to the channel. I appreciate your support. I'm 10,500 in the hole on my Call of Dragons account. So, thanks for your your free to play. Throwing a like on the video supports me tremendously. Thank you. Uh, Marcus Aurelius, thank you for the super chat. What are your thoughts on Lupine vestment gear? Um, is that the new gathering gear? I actually don't remember. Is that the new gathering gear? It's the new siege gear. Oh, the siege gear is really good. The siege gear is crazy good. Let me turn off my flicker. Sorry about that shot. Can we see the reports? Absolutely. All right. So that brings us to the following. One win for Khan. One win for Nevsky. Two wins for Khan. Three wins for Khan. Three out of four, man. For the Khan Nevsky. All right. Final um, testing, sort of. <laughs> we'll do four rounds now with archers. This is the final combo I really wanted to test, though. And then I think we could mess around with, with you trying some cool stuff. Um, XY secondary was an interesting idea, so we could try that. All right. Archers. Here we go. I expect to get racked. Boudicca E song, everybody. Hey, Pawn, what's up, dude? Oh my god. I am getting destroyed. That is brutal. Hi. <laughs> okay. Yikes. I feel like what the new relic system has done has kind of made it so that you could go all in again on one troop type in a way that you could not before, you know? I wouldn't say it's meta, but I think it's now viable in a way that it wasn't before. Sheesh. I mean, that's going to be some brutal reports in a minute here. Let's do it again three more times on this combo. Thirty thousand to twenty, yeah, that's pretty brutal. Con Ragnar, uh, I don't think you want Con Ragnar, but I also think it would work. You want skill damage. Remember, Con does a lot of skill damage. He does big, scary skill damage. Okay, round two. Um, you got a normal monitor connected to rock slash cod to a big TV. So, um, I'll just describe my setup very briefly. I have my camera right in front of me. I got a monitor here and a monitor here. Um, I got light, 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 green screens behind me. And I actually have my iPad in front of me as my sort of backup option. Also, it lets me keep tabs on, you know, other, other happenings. Whether it's a Rise of Kingdoms account or a Call of Dragons account. And keep my eye on what's good and what's happening. Like right now, I gotta send a gatherer. GG. Let's, let's gather. We ride. Marcus Aurelius, then which commanders would you use the gear with? So, thank you again for the super chat. The siege gear is designed for the ranged commanders. The Siege Gear is really, really good for ranged combat specifically. 
Um, I am going to be making the ranged gear on my farm account and then using my farm to set up towers and places. And like, we'll see how that goes. I'll try it for a KVK and see what I think. The interesting thing about ranged formation is that when you set up your tower, you can get War Frenzy and then you'll just auto attack whatever comes into range. So my goal is to just set it up, you know, like use the second device, right? Have it to the side, just set up the tower and then mostly play the main, you know? We'll see if it works. I don't know, it might be too much multitasking. Um, no, we're going to test Khan Mina as well. Hi, hi, hi. Do you stand all the time? I stand all the time. I honestly was talking about earlier today how I need to get a, a treadmill desk. I, I stand too much. I need a treadmill desk. At least I could be walking, you know? That'd be good. Holy cow, do we even need to do a, a fourth test? I feel like we should for posterity. We'll do the fourth test. But like, it is interesting to just see the cavalry absolutely decimate archers, which we know that it would do. But a player like Saz with seven cavalry marches can basically just try to pick off the, the archers and wreck them, which I think is not a bad plan, man. All right. One more time. Nevsky Khan works. Treadmill Desk is a brilliant investment. I think I should do it. I mean, even if I only end up walking, you know, like 100 calories a day, let's call it, that'd be, it's just free to me. Like, I'm just standing here anyways, right? It would be literally free to me to do that. That seems, when I put it like that, it seems like actually really dumb that I haven't done it. Con Ethel? Bro. Bro. Can you do Guan Leo for old times sake? GG. Um, I'm going to stick to Guan Skippy if I use that. I, I think for the next rounds of fun testing, I'm going to go back to Nevsky Joan. Um, but Saz, could you, after this finishes, do Khan with Mehmed? And let's just get a look at how that goes. Um, and that'll let you bring more troops, and you should bring the full troop amount. Because uh, Mehmed has extra troop capacity. All right, I'm going to bring Nevsky Chon. Chat wants to see Khan, Mehmed, and they... I think they're right. That could be pretty cool. When is the Call of Dragons stream? Uh, it's like an hour after reset. So later tonight, we do the Elite Hydra raid and train up a bunch of T5s. Perfect stream to just chill and eat your dinner. Yeah, hey, you know, kick back. We got some commander testing going on over here. What about Khan Saladin? Yeah, I mean, we could do a Khan Saladin. We could also do that. I mean, we got all... Yeah, yeah Saz has it all, man. Saz, Saz has all the commanders. I don't know if we got the double relic on Mehmed, but we'll find out. Let's, uh, let's run the test and see. All right, Khan Mehmed, baby. What's good? Let's find out. Oh my god. Chat, that is disgusting. <laughs> Hello? Uh. Khan Chandra? I suppose we could do Khan Chandra. Uh. Okay, I think this is not doing as well as I thought it might. But also. I want to look at the report. Is this double relic or single relic? Chandra. Con double C. Uh, uh, okay, so so the chat. Nevsky Jones getting the W here, all right? Nevsky Jones getting the W. Keezer, chat says. The con Caesar combo. 
Yeah, I think what we do next is Con Caesar. I want to see Con Caesar. I'm actually super intrigued by that combo. Tier list, please. Um, yeah, so I got to update my tier list to take Khan and all these other commanders out of the dumpster and back into the relevant column because chat, they're, they're good. All right, uh, Khan Caesar, if you please. And if I look at this report... It is the double... That was double relic on Mehmed chat. That was double relic. How are you using the default cursor in the game? Uh, I have changed no settings and this is the cursor it gives me. Khan Takeda. So the weirdest there is that Khan is amplifying skill damage and Takeda doesn't do skill damage. Like it's probably fun. Wait, was Mephmet only 230k? Oh, could you run that again with Khan Mehmed, but bring uh, the full amount of troops, actually? That was a good catch, chat. I also didn't notice. Yeah, you can bring more troops because of Mehmed's uh, fourth skill. So we want you to have those troops. All right, I'm going to get the old scouteroo on you. Boink. Oh, yeah, there we go. 250k. All right, chat. 250k. Here we go, chat. Here we go. I'm very interested in this. Let's see if that changes. Oh my god, look at the normal attack damage I'm taking. What the? Oh, that must have been a ring proc. Hi. Okay. Isn't it 2060? No. Um, or 260? It's 10% uh, boost, I believe, on Mehmed, and a 15% boost on Freddy and Caesar. Khan Joan is not good. Um, I talked about it earlier in the stream. I actually have a dedicated video about why that combo doesn't work. Why didn't you pick skills to test an Ark of Osiris? Uh, we're not, we're not trying to use the skills. Khan City Keeper? Nah. Nico Clash says, yeah, it's 10% extra troops. Yeah. It is definitely true that the 430 to 450 isn't as big a deal as 230 to 250. All right, let's do XY secondary. So con XY, chat wants to see it. I'm intrigued. Oh, also con Caesar. Oh, whichever one you want to do first. All right, what do we got? Oh, Con Caesar, 260K. All right, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Caesar. <laughs> yes. And then Con Mina. Oh, yeah, we got to do Con Mina for sure. For sure. Con Caesar. This should work, but... It does not look like it's working, chat. It does kick into high gear with the tankiness now that they're getting low, but I don't think it quite does it. It might not be double relic, though, chat. Well, I'll look in the report in a second. Is Mina CC still good with the second museum buff um i haven't run around with double relic mina double relic cc caesar should be the primary yeah i don't know 
I think this is a no-go. Good to good to test. I right, always good to test, but a no-go. Convert. Mm, I'm intrigued, but um, let's do the Minamoto. Let's try that first. Uh, Con Mina. Ah, uh, it's, it's only single relic. Chad, it's only single relic on the Caesar. Um, so it could be different with a double, but I don't know if it'd be that different. I mean, 19k to 33k is pretty brutal. Oh, yes. Okay. You got the Mina. Let's go. Kind of hyped. All right. Here we go. Con Mina. This could be pretty good. When am I playing Call of Dragons next? Uh, Call of Dragons is going to be tonight, like an hour after reset. We do the Elite Hydra, and I'm going to train a ton of T5 before that. Regular Hydra's in under an hour. Yeah, true. Yeah, I actually got to be paying attention to that. I'm, I'm supposed to go to regular Hydra. I'm going to have to march myself over there. Con Richard, bro. Yeah, we'll check if the Mina's double relic. And um, up next, we'll do Con XY. I think that's a cool idea. 100%. We haven't tried a Con Rally. That, that would take a, a different practice match. Do you think there's going to be an Alex buff? Absolutely, man. Absolutely. Alex buff should be coming next. Because remember, the Cavalry, Salad, and Khan came out first, so they'll they'll get there, I think. Okay. Favorites? That is double Relic on the Minamoto. So the Khan, the Khanamoto didn't quite do it. The Khanamoto didn't cut it, chat. Please remember William. Yeah, sure. We'll do an XY and then we could do William. I'm game. In KVK2, is Khan worth getting now? Um, I, I, I think it is probably going... My, I think my conclusion is going to be that it is viable, but not meta. So, like, I think you could do it. And I think you have a way to make it work. But I, I'm not going to call it meta. All right, here we go. Con XY, chat. The fastest skill cycles in the West. But also literally no tanky stats whatsoever. Looks like it's a bit of a yikes. Oh, you know what we should do also? Is a Khan Saladin. We gotta do that one of those. Yeah, 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 yeah. Khan Saladin also. God, we have so many things on the list. Oh, uh, we can't we can't switch around who's primary because the gear is on Khan. The Khan Saladin's a good idea. Any tips? I just started a new account. Check out the link in the description of this video for my beginner playlists. That's what you need. All right. Con XY. No go, chat. No go. You want to see Con Honda? I wouldn't be opposed to that either. Con Honda is a good idea. We could do Con Honda. Right, chat? What do you think? Con, Con Honda. All right, Con Saladin, though, chat. So this is Relic Con Relic Saladin. Sneak peek for the Relic Saladin testing that's going to come later. Relic Saladin. 
Ain't bad, man. It ain't bad. It's only 10% attack and 10% march speed, but 10% attack is meaningful. I don't think it's going to get the win, though. Yeah, we did con Mina. It was just okay. This is an expertise relic Saladin, correct? It's Saz, man. So Saz has literally every Cav Commander maxed. We could do Burt. You want to do Con Burt? We do Con Burt. Sure. We could do Birdie. I'm I'm game. Um, I think the Saladin Relic is attack. And the Con Relic is defense. I could be misremembering. I think Saladin Relic is 10 attack, 10 speed. Yeah, let's, let's use uh, Bertrand secondary. Con Bertrand. Kind of curious what that looks like. Let's test with CC. Yeah, we could also do con CC. That would work. And chat really wants to see the con Joan. Oh, we could also do that. I mean, any of these cav commanders. I know it's a lot of scrolling around for calves, but... Yeah, that'll work. Let's try it. All right, here we go. Con CC. Mountain Man, what's up, dude? You want to see Nevsky paired with Nevsky? GG. You love seeing the Khan on the field? Yeah, I mean, if you're into history, this has got to be pretty cool. If you could have only one pair expertise, what would it be? Probably Nevsky Joan. Or Guan Skippy. Or Sargon Skippy. Skippy Sargon. Would be one of those combos. Khan needs more defense, though. So Mina or Saladin for sure. Khan Chandra. We have not done Chandra Gupta. No, I mean, um, for the next test, uh, this is actually closer than you might have expected, chat. I think for the next test, um, Let's see here. I got a walk in Call of Dragons. These boots are made for walking. How long until this Hydra? Well, I got an hour and 40 minutes. Now nah, I got time on Hydra, man. I got I got some time on Hydra. All right. All right. Looks like uh, Bert. Nice. All right, chat con Bert, I believe, with the sword. See how that works. Does not appear to be terrible. But it also does not appear to be working. Con Honda. Yeah, we do Con Honda. I feel like Greek Civ's gotta be infantry. Bert is a meme. Bert is awfully tragic. a bit of a yikes. I 
All right. All right. Only so many tests we get to do here. Probably like three more, chat. And that's it. Use Burton Canyon. I feel like Burt is a really good primary for his defense tree. He gets really tanky. So let's do either Khan Chandra or people want to see Khan Jones. So we can give the people what they want. Um, yeah, Any of those would be good. There's probably a couple other combos we talked about that would be totally cool. Let's look at this. Is this double C double relict? Troop buffs. Yeah, it was double relict. Wow. All right, what do we got? Khan with? Chandra Gupta, baby. Let's go. Does not seem to cut it. Oh. No, that's not William. That's Chandra. Um, yeah, it's on purpose that you can't hear. Uh, comms. We're, we're in a public kingdom chat that anybody can jump into. And you, know, and you never know what's going to happen in 1254. I did hear about that mountain, man. That's crazy. All right. Chat wants to see Con William. I think we could do Con William and then Con Joan. And then we call it. Well, we'll probably run out of time. I do feel very validated that Nevsky... Oh, yeah, Khan Honda. No, no, no. I really want to see Khan Honda. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, if you get Khan Honda and make sure you use the maximum troop amount, that also would work. Ooh. Yeah, I think this is what we, what we got to see. Yeah, okay, let's do it. This is kind of exciting. We already did Khan Caesar. Um, Khan Williams on the menu. But we got Khan Honda, baby. Let's see what it, what happens here. We got Konda lined up here. Okay. Um. Ooh. The tankiness is good, but I just don't think it is doing enough damage somehow. That's interesting. Doesn't quite cut it. It ain't bad though. But the thing is that in just a second, the normal attack damage taken reduction is going to wear off, and then it's going to go sideways, I think. Ah, maybe I'm wrong. Earl Grey, cheers. I appreciate you, dude. Also, I used to drink a lot of Earl Grey tea, but I had to quit caffeine at one point, doctor's orders. And when I quit caffeine, um, let me tell you, I learned that... Uh, Caffeine literally controls the, like, speed that blood flows to your brain, which is why you get a migraine when you haven't had caffeine after a while. It was pretty rough. Not gonna lie. So now I just do green. Just green tea for me now. All right. We got Con William or Con Joan. Those are the last two we're gonna test. All right, it looks like it's William, baby. Let's go. Con Freddy won't be good. I mean, we tried with Con Bert, which was not particularly good. We're going to do Joan just to satisfy the chat. Green tea has higher caffeine, not than black tea. Green tea is like, I don't know, 10 or 15 milligrams or whatever of caffeine. Black tea is like a full cup of coffee strength. Matcha is higher caffeine than black tea, if that's what you're thinking of. Matcha is freaking caffeinated. That'll freaking do it.
green tea has much less caffeine. Yes. So green tea still has caffeine, but it's like way, 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 way less. So instead of doing like multiple cups of black tea and a green tea every day, I just do one cup of green tea in the morning and that's it. That's the whole thing. Dang, William is clapping cheeks, dude. I think it's because William is removing skill damage. So I really like this combo because first of all, it removes skill damage buffs. Second of all, when you're hitting lots of things, you're going to get good um, uptime on the defense and rage boost. Wow. Con William chat. Okay. Oh, okay. That's good. That works. I give that the seal of approval. Even though it got the L, that was good. Firing off the active skill on William more frequently is really good. All right, uh, final combo, the Joan. Con Joan. Yeah, William is like top three Cav Commander, right? All right, here we go. The final battle, Con Joan. You can see if if it happens, and it doesn't always happen, that it'll get gummed up on the active skills potentially. They just be sitting there. See it? Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, there it is. Just sitting there with the full rage bar for like a couple turns. Because it's still got downtime on the previous active skill activation. Dude, it literally like trips itself. Yeah, I'm in KVK on my restart account. Kingslands on Sunday. Con Ethel Flood. Um, honestly, very tempting, but we just don't have time. Yeah, it's like a self-silence. It's not good. Amazing. Saz, thank you so much for spending time with me to do this testing. I very much appreciate it. Thank you. Um, chat, what did we learn today? Khan is viable with either Nevsky or William. What do you think? That's what I think. Khan is viable with either Nevsky or William. Yeah, the Khan had gear. Khan had the best gear in the game, and I matched it. Okay, Khan had the best gear in the game, and I matched it. I'm a little bit behind, though, on my Nevsky Joan. I'm a little bit behind on my Boudicca Isong, but I pretty much matched it. This is your first live stream? Hey, welcome to the live stream, Dotic. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is a fun one, honestly. Did we try Mina? We did try Mina. Mina was surprisingly not great. It, it was actually kind of surprising. Okay. Khan probably only good as a secondary. Um, I mean, uh, you know, I have had white tea actually. Okay, let's uh, fix the gear. Um, I'm going to pop out a voice, Saz, but uh, thank you again for testing with me. I really, really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. Um, let me get back to the old Canyon lineup here. Switch this around. See how easy that is? Boom. We just go back to wedge. We're good, baby. We're good. We switch this back to wedge. Easy. Love how easy that is. You hyped for your upcoming KVK? Yeah, I don't know if we're going to get match found or what, but... It's it's um going to be fine for us either way, I think. 
we either get into the hell kvk or we get into kvk now and either is like really fine like, whatever's good man um richard canyon Khan always gets targeted in the field. Yeah, the thing is that you you might target that in the field, but when Saz rolls up with max tech, max crit, max iconic gear, um, good luck. Yeah, you might focus his Khan, but he's gonna have six other marches that are ready to do work. Uh, Alex over Constantine. Alex over Constantine for sure. There was a window of time where Constantine was really cool, but we've left that window. You want to see Orleans KVK? I would like to see Orleans KVK as well. You want to see the Hell KVK? I want to see the Hell KVK as well. <laughs> uh, yeah, we are queued, chat. We are queued. A bunch of kingdoms pulled the punch. Three three big kingdoms pulled the punch on this one. They they decided not to do it. So we'll see how it works out. 846 did not pull the punch. And 365 did not pull the punch. So they're they're there still. How's my relationship with Nephisto? I don't know. I wouldn't exactly say I have a relationship with Nephisto. HMB Boats, what's up, dude? All right, chat, here's the deal. Here's the deal. I got to go do dinner with the family, but I'm going to be back tonight for troop training and the Elite Hydra. You're not going to want to miss it, all right? Subscribe to the channel. Thank you again, Saz, for this testing. I'm hoping to do more testing with you with the Saladin. Looking forward to it. Subscribe so you don't miss it. Throw that like on the stream, and until next time. You have fun smashing the kingdom. I'll see y'all real soon. Take care, everybody.